Hello there, gamers! It's me, Daily Tactics here, and I have something serious I need to address. There are accusations going around that I, Daily Tactics, am preferable to the Clone Trooper Army, that I am a staunch Clone Trooper supporter who spits on any other faction from Star Wars? Well, you'd all be right, because I am. But uh, there have been a lot of people saying that I haven't been paying enough attention to the Separatists, Rebels, Resistance, Stormtroopers, and First Order, and Old Republic, and Sith Troopers, and all of the troopers in these LEGO videos. And I have to say, you're completely right. And uh, we need to give credit where credit is due and build those armies alongside our Clone Trooper army. So today, we're gonna be starting with the Separatist Battle Droid Army in LEGO. Uh, we're gonna be building it together. All of the LEGO droids that I have currently are gonna be on display, and it's gonna be poggers. So let's get right on into it, boys. Be sure to hit the like button if you enjoyed. Uh, let's try and get 2,000 likes in the first 24 hours. Subscribe if you haven't already. We're gonna be doing a huge LEGO giveaway at 200,000 subs. And comment down below what your favorite uh, type of droid is, I suppose. All right, let's get into it, boys. Okay, fellas, so uh, what we need to do is first of all, assemble the Separatist droid army. So. I have two bags full of droids right here and right here. These are all of my personal battle droids um, that I have collected over the years from uh, my various LEGO Star Wars sets and whatnot. These are my personal ones. These ones over here are all fan donated Lego Star Wars battle droids. So um, that is sort of the first bunch that we'll be setting up. But wait, there's more. Over here, guys, next to the decal stuff that I'm still planning on doing, but I'm too lazy to learn how to right now, we have another set of battle droids. These ones I bought off of, I think it was DK Collectibles? It might have been DK Collectibles or Jonak Toys. I can't remember exactly which one it was. But I did buy uh, 20 of them, I believe. Um, all standard B1s. If you go on to uh, DK Collectibles and want to droid build... Sorry. <laughs> I can't talk today. Build up your uh, droid or clone trooper army. Use code DAILY, D-A-L-E-Y, for 10% off. But that's enough plugging. Uh, yes. More droids over here. But wait, there's more than that, because I believe, actually, in the LEGO minifigure box, which is actually the Total Tank Simulator box uh, that the Total Tank Simulator people gave me, um, I believe there might be a few extra droids in here. I know there's a stop speeder with a droid attached to it, so I'll have to look through this box of minifigs and uh, find if there's any more battle droids in here. On top of all of those things, fellas, I have uh, in my bathroom sink here uh, a ton of Lego figures. This was all from that fan mail video I did the other day, the massive one. Um, I, I clean all of the fan mail figures uh, just in case someone was sick or something like that, especially with coronavirus going around. You know, you can never be too careful. So uh, I do clean all of the figures nowadays, but... Um, these I will take out, put into this bowl, and then uh, I believe there's some more droids in here. Yeah, there definitely are. So we'll also have to sort through all of these. Oh my god. Oh, it's going to be epic, but it's going to be a pain in the butt. So let's get on with it here. Boys, uh, when I come back, I'll sort through everything and pick out all of the droids from these. All right, guys. So this is 46 different B1 battle droids here. I just set these guys up from the um, ones I purchased, my old collection, as well as that little bag of uh, fan scent mail stuff. I still have uh, the bowl here to look through, as well as this thing. I'm considering actually putting in the Geonosians because they're, I mean, kind of part of the Separatist droid army, and of course we need to do the B2 battle droids, um, and then I've got some mismatched rando droids over here I need to go through as well and put in, but I wanted to do the B1s first, so uh, there will be more added to this probably, but uh, I got some serious sorting to do here, boys, so um, I'll be back when that's done. I just thought I'd give you a little update. 
All right, guys, these are the droidy boys that I got from the big bucket. It's actually the next day because I, I started sorting through the whole bucket and then got bored of sorting through the whole bucket and then just took out the droid parts today. Um, we also have a, a new Gunray hat here, I noticed. I know I have the head for him, but I don't know if I have the body for him. So he may or may not be the leader of this droid army. We also pulled out two additional Grievances. So I actually have uh, three General Grievances. Plus, I have actually a fourth one from a set that I never opened up as a kid. I have a lot of general grievances. Either way, I'm gonna line up all the rest of the droids and we'll be able to see the droid army. Alright guys, here we go! The droid army is completed and I'm actually kind of impressed by it. I thought it'd be smaller than this, but no, it's actually pretty decent. Um, so let's uh, let's jump into it. First of all, we have three general grievances here. Um, here's two over here. This one has the, the quad arm, but the other two just have the, have the normal general grievous arms. Um, and then here is the leader leader, even though there's three of them, of um, the droid army, General Grievous here, with two uh, commander droids there in yellow. Behind them, we only had one uh, red security droid, actually, which is kind of disappointing. I think we're definitely going to need to buy more red security droids because I, I really like the security droids. I think they look kind of sick, to be honest. Um, I don't know if they're more expensive than the, than the blue ones, but I imagine they are if we only had one of them, right? I don't know. We have uh, six of those blue ones, though. Uh, those ones are, I mean, easier for us to come by, I guess, but I don't know if they're easier to come by than the red ones, like I was saying before. Um, then we have two of the uh, Kashyyyk troopers. I put them on the opposite ends there. Those guys are sick, too. Honestly, I think what we need to buy um, for the future of this army, what I am going to buy probably pretty soon, because I would like to do a second video of this, is I want to buy a ton more colored ones. Like, I'd like to have a row of colored, of each color one. You know, a row of uh, Kashyyyk troopers, a row of blue troopers, the pilot troopers, whatever they are, and a row of the red security droids. Um, maybe not commander droids, because that just doesn't make as much sense. I think two is enough of those, but I, I would like to get a row of all the other colored ones. Either way, then we have um, four rows of uh, B1 battle droids. I believe there's 16 droids in a row, so that would mean there are 64 total. However, at the very end here, we have one Geonosis trooper. Um, surprisingly, that's all I had to make Geonosis troopers with. Um, I actually have more Geonosis trooper parts over here, but not enough to make an entire trooper. I'm missing one arm to make a complete trooper for those guys, which is kind of funny. Um, so I got pieces parts for them, but I was only able to make one in total. Um, and I just happened to have one spot available uh, where I didn't have a B1 battle droid, which is kind of funny as well. Either way, then I had the super battle droids, um, where I have uh, 17 of those, actually. Some are actually different colors. Um, some are a lighter gray, some are a darker gray. One of them has those beefy boy arms. I don't know what set he was a part of. That's a unique one right there. Um, and then I had to tack on an extra one at the end. I had the opposite problem I had with the battle droids, with the super battle droids. I had one extra one. Um, so he's just tacked on at the end there. Uh, but then the very back lane here, we have uh, five of these commando droids. One of them does have that in... Someone's honking their horn outside. I have the window open because it's so bloody hot out. Um, so I apologize if it's a little bit more noisy, but yeah, one of the uh, commando droids does have this face paint on Which is kind of interesting. I uh, don't know what set he's from, uh, but I do like the commando droids I think they're cool. I think they're neat uh, Then I also added some of these uh, IG assassin droids to the army cuz why not? I mean, I'm sure the separatists employed them sometimes these guys are pretty mismatched. I have two um, Of the black ones fully made and then two of the silver ones fully made and then this guy is just complete Mod podge of random parts, uh, and then this guy's just got a gray stud head. I'm sure I have a black stud somewhere, but I was too lazy to try and find it. Uh, so, <laughs> there's that. Then in the very back, I have one of these dwarf spider droids. Um, that's the only real vehicle I have for the droids. I do have a stop speeder, but it's missing a lot of parts, so I didn't include it in this. Um, but yeah, I mean, that's the droid army here. I think it's pretty sweet looking. Honestly, I, I actually really like this. I think it... I think it's a solid droid army. 
I think it's solid. I think what I would like to get is maybe like two, I might buy two more of these B1 Battle Droid rows. So 32 more B1 Battle Droids, well 33 so I can replace the Gene Ocean one. Um, then of course do the thing with the colors that I mentioned. I think we're good on Super Battle Droids. I'd like to get an entire row of Commando Droids, I think that would be cool. Um, and then maybe a row of Gene Ocean Troopers as well, I think that might be swell as well. Um, that rhymed. <laughs> I'd also like to get a full new gun, right? We have the hat. I know I have the head li laying around somewhere, but I don't think I have the body. Um, so yeah, I might buy those things um, and, and do a second video of this and just really expand the droid army to make it bigger. Um, and then I might stop because I don't think the droid army is nearly as fun to collect for as the clone trooper army, but I still think it looks cool when you line them all up and get them all in the proper order. I, I think it's pretty sick. Um, I do have a bunch of spare parts for these guys. Uh, which I thought was kind of funny, um, like, just, if I had just the right parts, I could make another droid or whatever, but I just, I'm just missing some wrong parts, so, that's kind of funny, but, um, yeah, I mean, I'm sure I'll get random parts from random orders and things like that in the future, so maybe I'll make some more. I also have this painted droid I did when I was a kid. Ugh. I decided not to actually add the Geonosians to the army. I decided to just stick with droids for now. Maybe in the sequel we'll do Geonosians. I'm pretty sure I only have three Geonosians. I have this guy and then two others um, that I own as well. So they wouldn't have made that big of an addition. Either way, guys, that's probably just going to do it for this video. I wanted to say thank you all so, so much for watching. Um, it's been a really stressful week this week. So I'm sorry if the content hasn't been um, as great as it usually is. Um, I've just had a ton on my plate lately and uh, work's been getting kind of rough and, and stuff and I don't know, it's just made me cranky. I, I had some in interactions I regret to be completely honest on live stream like if someone was spamming and I just kind of snapped at him and was like stop! Stop! And I was like afterwards in, in hindsight I did apologize in stream. I was like I'm sorry I snapped. I'm cranky today. But, uh, you know, I, I just wish I had taken a breather. So, I, I'm sorry if the videos had, uh, you know, been affected by this at all um, or anything like that. I don't mean to be cranky. I just, I just have been. Um, so, I do apologize about that. But, I'm... Oh. That was a skid and a half outside. I wonder if you could hear that. Whoa. Huh. That was crazy. I just heard a car skid out. Um... Yeah, back to what I was saying, um, I, I, I am going on vacation this weekend and I think that will alleviate a lot of the stress and I'll come back next week ready to roll better than ever. Um, so I did want to just apologize in case the quality had gone down or if, you know, I just seem crankier or something. I, I think this week has just been challenging, but I'm ready to, to move on, have a nice little vacation, and then come back better than ever, which I think will be great. Either way, guys, I do want to say I really appreciate all the support on the videos that you guys give me. Um, it's phenomenal. I, I love having an audience like you guys, and I'm glad we were able to start doing Lego stuff because this could have flopped and I never would have done it again, but the fact that you guys embraced it so much really means a lot. So thank you guys. I'll stop rambling because I tend to ramble when I get going, uh, and I'll, I'll talk to you all later. Peace. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Be sure to click that subscribe button for more content and hit the notification bell if you'd like to be alerted to whenever I live stream or upload. Thanks so much.